Good morning, friends. Coach Campbell here. First of all, I want to say how proud I am of you for how hard you worked yesterday on the first day of school, first day of e-learning. Um, it wasn't easy. Maybe it was. And it's so awesome. If it was a little bit challenging and there were parts that you weren't sure about, I understand we had those moments too. A couple of uh, conversations with teachers, though, made it a lot easier. So I'm proud of you. Keep up the good work. We're in it for the long haul. We love you so much. Let's begin in prayer. In the name of the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Spirit, amen. God, let me play well but fairly. Let competition make me strong but never hostile. Forbid me to rejoice in the adversity of others. See me not when I am cheered, but when I bend down to help my opponent out. If I know victory, allow me to be happy. If I am denied, keep me from envy. Remind me that sports are just games. Help me to learn something that matters once the game is over. And if through athletics I set an example, let it be a good one. Amen. In the name of the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Remember, don't forget to check with your parents before you do any of the things that we talk about here. But I had my first day of Zooming with my students at H&J over lunch. And I asked for suggestions about what they would like me to talk about on my YouTube channel. And today's suggestion came to us from Elena. Hey, Elena. And she asked that we talk about cleaning foods before eating, which is fantastic, cleaning our fruits and vegetables. Now, there's some common knowledge things. Wash your fruits and vegetables before you eat them. Wash them under um, cool water. Scrub them gently with your hands, or if they're harder fruits and vegetables, you can scrub them with a brush. But there were some interesting things that I learned that I hadn't thought about before. Uh, the USDA recommends not um, soaking your vegetables in the sink because the drain harbors a lot of bacteria and that exposes your fruits and vegetables to those bacteria that have been growing in your drain. So they suggest uh, if you're going to soak your fruits and vegetables to do them, soak them in a bowl. Another thing it said is don't wash your uh, foods fruits and vegetables with bleach or any detergents. Our fruits and vegetables are porous, and so they'll absorb the bleach or the, uh, the soap that you are washing it with. So make sure you don't wash your fruits and vegetables with any kind of bleach or any kind of detergent. Now, some people wash their fruits and vegetables with vinegar, which the USDA didn't recommend, but is completely safe because vinegar is a food that we consume as human beings. So there's no danger to washing your fruits and vegetables with vinegar. So if you're doing that and it works for your family, awesome. Keep up the good work. Um, there are some fruits and vegetables that you don't need to wash. For example, bananas. Bananas peels are gross, so you could wash them. They come from tropical environments. They're all grown together in mice and um, spiders crawl over them in their transport. So it's a good idea to wash them because the outsides are gross, and if you eat them without washing them, your hands are going to be gross. Um, but you don't have to wash something that you're not going to consume the peel. If you're going to consume the peel, it's super important to wash them. Or if you're going to touch the plant with your hands after you eat them, it's also important to wash the outside of the fruit. Um, there's not a lot of information about... COVID-19 and caring for your foods differently because of COVID-19. Um, the articles that I read said just keep doing what you're doing. Make sure you're washing the outsides of fruits and vegetables under uh, cold water and scrubbing them with your hands. So I'm sure we're going to learn a lot as this goes. And if I find an update that says something different, I'll make sure I get back to you guys right away and let you know. Uh, but that's all I have to talk about today. Uh, so if you eat a healthy food or vegetable, feel free to put it in the uh, comments below. I'd love to see what you're eating. And Elena, thanks so much for the question. I enjoy doing the research and finding out about um, the drain and not washing them with soap because it gets absorbed by the pores of the fruits or vegetables. You guys, again, so proud of you. Keep up the good work. My students at H&J. I'd love to Zoom with you at noon today and hear how you're doing. And um, hear if you have any questions that I might be able to answer on here. I love you guys. Have an awesome day. I'll talk to you soon.